Hi guys, how are you? I'm Noah from Tata Soul and today I want to show you how I embroidered my plants and macrame embroidery kit. That's right, my macrame embroidery kit. I embroidered macrame, it's very fun to do and I will show you in a bit, so let's start. Let's start with the plants. I'm using backstitch to make this one. You just pull your needle up and down through the fabric, but every step forward will be in the wrong side of the fabric. And then you come back to where the last stitch ended over the right side of the fabric. Now I'm using second stitch and I used two different shades of green to make it look more natural. I recommend stitching from the outside inside. I first make a stitch across the leaf and then fill with satin stitch. Then make back stitch for the branch. I used basic stitches in this embroidery to make it easier for beginners, but you can add more satin stitches if you like. So I'm back stitching the outline of this bench and you can later add satin stitch to fill the shape. To finish this project quickly, you can stitch only the outline of the shapes. To learn how to make backstitch or second stitch, check out the links to the videos I made just for that. They are waiting for you in the description box. For the pots, I also just added backstitch to the outline. For the pole, I decided to use satin stitch because it makes more sense with the macrame over it. So just fill the shape with your thread from one side to the other. Now for the main event, the macrame. First I make the rope that should be over the pole. You can know where they are supposed to be by the lines that go after the pole. There should be 9 sets of 2. Then, keep working your way down with backstitch. The final detail is the French knots. This is what's going to make this embroidery from cool to amazing. Wherever there are two ropes that meet, you add a French knot. It's not a complicated knot if you can follow the instructions slowly. So, Use the video I made specifically for this, it is also waiting for you in the description box. You can find this design as embroidery kit or PDF pattern at my shop. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to check out all my videos and tutorials. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!